guys, Maria here, and sorry if I kind of look weird because I'm wearing makeup right now since I've been starting to wear makeup more often. So, sorry if I kind of look weird to you guys, but anyways, this is going to be my birthday haul. Obviously, it says it in the title, but anyways, um, before I stay, uh, I can't talk. Before I get started, I wanted to do a quick disclaimer. If you are the type of person that does not enjoy these type of videos and hates them, I suggest you just exit out this video because I don't want any hate, hate comments on my channel. Just asking, please leave. And also, I'm not trying to brag in any way. I'm just making this video for fun and was hoping that my subscribers would love to see what I got for my birthday. And also, I'm super, super grateful for everything I've got. I haven't gotten gifts for like about two years since my dad's incident. And when, um, one of you guys requested me to do a drama life video, which I will do pretty soon once I find out my whiteboard. Um, but yeah, and I'll tell you everything that happened. Obviously, that's what drama life is. But anyways, enough of the talking on to show you guys what I got for my birthday. First off, I'm going to start off with my sister-in-law gave me. And first she gave me, um, the stuff came in this really, really cute bag. It kind of looks like a person. You can kind of tell, but it's just this. And she got me two books, and I was super, super happy that she gave me these books. It's just amazing how she knows me um, so much. Um, first off, she gave me the Rectus Journal. And if you guys want me to do a video series of me recording um, myself doing the pages of the book, I will do it for you. Just leave it in the comments below, and I'll be sure to make... My video series of me wrecking this journal and I'm super happy because I've seen a lot of people get it and I've been wanting one and I have one. So thank you so much for this and the last book she gave me which I am super happy for and I already started reading it and I'm like on chapter 10 already but you guys might already know what it is. It is The Fought in Our Stars. Oh my god like thank you so much. This I've been starting, like, I started this book yesterday, which was Monday, and today's Tuesday, and I'll be uploading this video on Friday, obviously. Um, but I started reading this, and for, like, barely starting reading it for the date, and I've got all the way to chapter 10. And you'll get surprised how much I was blushing while, I, like, reading this, because it's so cute. Like, August, Augustus, I think that's how you say his name. Augustus Waters, he is... A total cutie and he's super sweet and like I love his character and the book is just amazing and I just love this book and I'll keep reading on but like I kind of spoiled myself thanks to Instagram and um you can never trust Instagram okay you can never trust it um uh, but it told me something on chapter 21 that got me so pissed off because I I wasn't ready to like like oh my god I spoiled myself after that but then again yesterday I was like wait and Instagram told me about chapter 21 but I didn't know what it was but then I flipped through it I was in a rhythm it was like the first line I was like I'm done with my life because I kept spoiling myself and you know just hate myself for it and also hate Instagram I can't believe that account spoiled me but I'm still gonna keep reading this because this seems like an amazing book and sorry for my one of the pool in the background like I had him for like long time but anyways on to this um just thank you so much as you can see i'm saving my spot wait right there so uh, thank you so much her name is diana so if you're watching this thank you so much diana for these two books it means a lot and this one is the one where it has pictures inside which is pretty awesome i've seen other people that have the um the first ever like cover of the fall in the stars which was blue and stars on it like i I was probably wondering if she might get me that book, but she got me this one with their faces on it, which is pretty good, I guess you can say, because they have pictures inside, and I don't know, I just, okay, these two, thank you so much, Deanna, it meant so much to me to actually have you to know who I am, to actually know that I will, I've been wanting these books, I don't know what I'm saying, but thank you so much. The last thing she got me were events, and oh my god, guys, you guys know me. You guys know that I am obsessed with either Vans or Converse, but Vans, uh, thank you so much, Deanna. Like, I just love you so much right now. You're like the only person that loves me here, JK, but thank you so much. Like, you know what I want, you know what I love, and she got me Vans, and like, she didn't have to buy me Vans, like... Thank you so much, and they actually fit perfectly. I'm actually wearing them right now. Um, obviously, you can see through the camera, they're just a black back vents. I don't really care what kind of vents they were, but I've been wanting these for a really long time. And, like, thank you so much. It was either this one or the black ones with the white laces, but thank you so much. It means so much to me. And these costed her, like, 50 bucks, plus with the... I stopped that hard. Plus with the books, and it must have costed you a lot of money. And thank you so much for spending, like, that much time and money and effort for, like, even getting me a gift. It just means so much, and I just love my shoes. Like, I've been wearing them. This is, like, the second day I've been wearing them. Like... Yeah, second day I've been wearing them because I let them stay new in my closet for about two days and then I started wearing them because if I'm just going to leave them there, 
that would be stupid. So I just started wearing them. So, yeah, thank you so much, Deanna. I mean, so much. And then my sister's husband, he got me something in this envelope. So he got me a really, really cute birthday card. And I don't know if it's you or my sister that picks, because um, I know he's probably watching this. Because my niece somehow found me on YouTube. But they subscribed to me. So they'll probably be watching this. But um, I don't know if it's you or my sister that picks out the gifts. Not the gifts. The, um, the birthday cards. It's ca birthday cards? I don't know what I'm saying. Um, um, I don't know who you guys are who picks out the birthday cards. But they're always sticking cute every freaking year. And he picked out this. I think he's the one that picked it out. I don't know who picks out the birthday cards. But they are so adorable. So it's just this little ice cream. It's just so cute. And also like it's sparkly. So you cannot kind of tell. I guess you can. Yeah, you can't tell. But it also it's like sparkly on it. And it has the um, button that says believe on it. And you guys know I'm a sucker for buttons. I technically collect buttons. But um, looks like that. And right here. And the actual card is this, in the magic of wishes and the joys of little surprises and believe the world is a more wonderful place because of you. Happy birthday. And I'm not going to say the last name, but it says blank family with their names on it. Kaylee, Marco, Maria, Inez, and Jairo. And yeah. And then here wrote me a little sign over here, which is a little letter that says, I want to wish you a happy 15th birthday. God bless you. And has my nickname on it, which I'm not going to say. We love you very much. I hope give you the opportunity to have many more years. So thank you so much. That was sweet. And I just love to pick up cards. And he also gave me a hundred bucks, but my wallet is like up there. And I don't know. But if you guys don't believe me, here's a receipt that I've already bought stuff. Um, I bought like this is like a a McDonald's receipt. Yeah, because I technically bought McDonald's, so I wasted my twenty bucks on McDonald's. Was sucks, but um, I went shopping yesterday, which I went shopping on Monday, and I bought a few things from Target. As you guys already saw my Target haul, which is on my makeup channel. If you guys haven't seen it, my makeup channel is linked down in the description box. Um, and then yeah, I guess. So here's my cash. You guys didn't believe me. He gave me a hundred bucks and. 20, so thank you so much Heidel like you don't even know I just love you so much so thank you and um my auntie and my mom my mom's guy friend both got me money my auntie gave me 60 bucks and my mom's guy friend got me 50 bucks so thank you so much for both of you I've already spent them because my mom didn't tell me that the money was from you she just said let's go shopping but I would have saved those for something else. But anyways, thank you so much. Um, but I went to Forever 21. I bought a few things because my birthday was actually on Wednesday, June 18th. And, like, we came out early from school, which was amazing. And then, like, we went to the mall because there's, like, a mall in the back of our school. You just go and then you're at the mall. But um, I went there and spent my money. I got, like, a few accessories. And at two outfits. And for accessories, I got the earphones obviously and i've been needing earphones for like the longest time like the struggle of not having earphones it is the worst guys like i just hate it like i've lived in those times all the freaking time and i still live in it but now i have earphones so hopefully they, i don't lose them or break them or any of that because it sucks having no earphones like yeah but um i got these mint green ones that had like silver lining around them i was gonna get like the black ones with gold lining around them but i was like i don't know that's too some i can't think of the word it's like too um i don't know how i don't know the word is but these were not too girlyish or too tomboyish these were just like the perfect ones because girly will be like pink right but i got earphones and i've also got it lint rollers which is a Stupid idea, I know. Um, but it's, here's a lint roller and here's a re refill roll. And I don't know, they're just cute. Also because um, I've been having a lot of lint on my black clothes. And that sucks. So I just have this. And it's really cute. It's like hot pink right there. And then like the lint is the rent lint thing that catches the lint. It's polka dot. And yeah, I've gotten that. And then I got two makeup products. Which... Okay, sorry if you kind of heard that background noise. But anyways, I've gotten two makeup products. First off, I got the High Shine Gloss, and it's kind of shiny, sorry for that. The High Shine Gloss, and it's in red, if you can kind of see. And sorry, my thumb's red. 
get it? Um, yeah, because of my lipstick, so sorry. Um, if you guys were wondering what, what lipstick I'm wearing, it's in my Target haul video. Down Again, go check out my makeup channel. But anyways, I got this high shine gloss, and this is really cute. Like, okay, when you apply it on, it's like red, but not like this red, but like a little bit red. And it's kind of shiny. And then like after like a few hours, it turns like into a beautiful tinted pink. It's really amazing. It's kind of not long lasting, but it lasts for you like for like a while, which is a pretty, a pretty like decent time for you. And it's pretty good. So I like this. But the one I regret buying was this eyeliner. It's still Love and Beauty by Forever 21. And it's in black. I regret buying this because like it doesn't even come out black. It comes out brown. And like, okay, you open it. It kind of looks good to apply, right? When I saw the tip, I was like, wow, this is going to be easy to apply. It is sucky to apply. And it's just terrible. And it does not last long. It is liquid. So I don't know why it doesn't last long. And it's, it's just terrible. And it comes out brown. And I just I don't like it. So I regret buying that. But I'll just stay with my color stay eyeliner. Which is better than that one. So that's all the accessories I've got here, and I'm going to show you my outfits. Now, for the first outfit, it is first off, I got this flowery crop top, which I've been seeing a lot of people wear lately. And I found this one though, because I've seen people wear flowery tops, but I haven't seen this one, so I decided to get this one because it's super cute and it's like a crop top kind of like it shows a little bit of your tummy. You can kind of like measure how much space they want to show on your tummy that's how i really like about it and what i also like about it it's not like one of those show off shoulders or just like short cut off ones they're just like long enough which is pretty comfortable and i got this action it looks like this and then to go with that shirt i got a skirt and sorry if my bottoms have hangers on them i just hung them up but it's just this skirt and it has leather down here and leather on top and i really really like how it looks with this skirt it's just really cute um matches very well and i've been wanting a skirt that has leather just like those i wanted a leather circle skirt but i found this and i thought wow i need to have this and this is so cute it's like tight like cinched in in your hips and then it goes out which is really really cute it's flowy and it goes perfectly well with the flurry shirt and i actually wore this with like these two together on my birthday party which was on friday and I also if you guys follow me on instagram i have a picture of me wearing this flurry top with the makeup as well that was the day of my birthday party and then next off i have these American flag shorts, they're like denim shorts, and the back they look like that, which I really, really love. So it's just on one side right here, it's just stripes, and then on the other side, it's just stars. I really, really like it, but what I hate about these, the zipper like broke off just for like one day of wearing the shorts. Like it was just on the last day of school, I wore it, and then like the zipper just on the first class. My first, um, technically it was my fifth period, but it was my first class I had because we were mixing up our periods on the week. So, like on the first class, I went into until that class ended in snack time, if that you kind of get me. Um, but, like, I saw that my zipper was on, but then my zipper broke. As you can kind of see right there, it just broke completely for just wearing it, a, like, barely a day. And I had, like, only two classes that day, which pretty sucked. And we came out early, and that's, that just totally sucked. But it still goes up well, and then I just have to push it up or push it down. But instead of that, I really like it. And it's also perfect for the 4th of July. And the top that goes with this, it is super cute. The top that I actually worn with those shorts are in the, like, my dirty clothes in my laundry basket i guess you could kind of say because i wore it yesterday with some black shorts if you kind of saw in my target haul video um again it's on my makeup channel um it's that superman shirt i was wearing it in the video of my target haul video that was on my makeup channel that kind of made sense to you but besides that um i just really like that shirt it was like cut like imagine this with a superman shirt it was cut it's like you see how this is cut right here it was cut all the way further down to right here and it was just really cute and it was just a superman shirt and it was like a crop top as well like it showed like a little bit like it was up at least I really really liked it. It was just cute and Superman is just my my second favorite superhero. And if you want to see what the shirt looks like, um, again I worn it in my Target haul video. It's on my makeup channel and my makeup channel is linked in the description box. But the last thing I got from Forever Twenty One were these cute black sneakers. They're not just plain black sneakers. This is what they look like in the back, and I really really like it. I guess that's tribally print. I I don't know. I don't really know my prints that well. But I just have these, and I just, it's just unique and cute. And they're sneakers. Come on. If I wear skirts and dresses, I have to wear sneakers that kind of go with the skirt and dresses. And I worn this with my skirt and flowery top. And they looked perfectly cute together. And they were super comfortable. So, yeah. And I just really, really like this. Like, it's cute. And, wow, I just dropped it. So, yeah. So, that was it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please give it a big thumbs up. If you have it, still give it a big thumbs up. Because, why not? Anyways, don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe. All my social links will be down in the description box, as always. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye. I'm not leaving you. I'm not leaving you. You know why? Because I let Ken go of my recording. Yeah, okay, bye! I told you I wanted to let you guys go. And I kind of forgot. I also got lingerie from Forever 21. I always forget to mention that in my videos. Because it's also kind of private. But, yeah. Um, I guess that's it. I guess. That I got. But, again, see you next week.